Let's go. Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. Mm-hmm. You probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here, before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn or stop, always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space alien. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help people. Yeah. Sounds like Dad. Hello, friends. This is the Danicast with our debate. And that's your intro. Lame. We in the business call that carrying the lead. Hype it up! Let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while... Simultaneously excuse me. Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. What a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop. And I just started calling myself the problem. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. Couldn't last, though. Your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron. If you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh... Hmm. behind me.
probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. Maybe. But it's probably too quiet to work well. back there. <sighs> There's a lot of birds around here. Maybe? too far away. Not this way. Probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, I'm not gonna find it over here. Nah, getting too far away. <laughs> How did Dad record this? Is he a pigeon whisper? This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. Place was swarming with pigeons. The dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear, and Dad had the ear for music. Good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station. No. 
not this way. I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. He wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure he died trying. You did make things better, Dad. And so will I. Neighborhood user just spotted a weapons deal going down. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose them. Sound you needs like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. Good to see Feast out here. But that sound would drown out the rest of the track. Pretty sure it's behind me. Electric. Billboard or a sign? This way. Oh, that's cool. Love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself the problem. Met my first client right under this sun. 
Neon flags hard to miss, and the crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. He never said anything, just turned and left. He didn't know everything, just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw where we were headed long before I did. If you would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven you. I know he would have. sound always feels like someone celebrating, even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too, so we had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. Now. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here afterwards. He bought us milkshakes. Strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that life. I was lying, but he believed me for a while. He's pretending to. Man, things got complicated between them. and the blocks around it are alive with sound. What you're looking for is light, distinct. Light, huh? Okay. Alright. Oh man, this is making me hungry. Not really a light sound, but... Definitely distinctive. That's enough of the freak show. Later, Spider-Man. New guy. What the? Yeah. Wind chimes. That sounds good. This plaza is where I had my first job. I was fresh out of high school then. Didn't have the gear or the mask. 
Guy paid me to mug his boss. Rough him up and take everything in his wallet. Your dad found out. He stood under those wind chimes yelling at me for an hour. But he never told our folks. He made me promise I'd stop stealing. Wish I kept my word. You deserve better. I wish you had too. Maybe you and dad would have stayed close. I can't imagine ever turning my back on my family. fun with this one. I had a repeat client I always met here. Got real used to waiting, listening, hearing this sound running on a tight schedule. A sound on a schedule? I met here used to take the ferry over from Jersey. Working for him was good money. Until he got busted. He's how your dad found out about the problem. Not that it was me, but that a thief was making it big in New York. And your dad volunteered for the case. I could feel him closing in. I had to try and guess which would be worse. I told him. But he caught me. That'd be me. I... I don't know what I'd do. That can't be the only reason Dad cut him off. Not if he fessed up. It just wasn't Dad. Hey, young blood. You got almost everything you need for the track. You just unlocked the spot where you could find the last piece. Hope it works for you. Spot in Harlem. Wonder what the last piece is. Thank <laughs> you. 